Hey, this is Emma and Sherry here walking down to start our honey extraction. We've got all of our equipment. We're lighting the smoker. First things first. We've got just, uh, what's in there, Mom? It's just um, smoker fuel that I bought at the bee store. The bee store. Is that Burt's Bees store? <laughs> called Nature's Nectar. Oh, it's Nature's Nectar. Bees. It's in Minnesota, just right over by Stillwater. Oh, nice. You can see the bees floating around in the video when they're zooming by. Kind of cool. Okay, right, we got it. I think we got that. That's just the top piece. Yep, and see, this is just like... So they got the smoker going, smells pretty nice. And then here are our little friends. Hope and you can see them okay. Like wave this over the top here. Look at all these pretty ladies. So we're loosening up the just trying to get one loose so that we can get get to work here. They have them so so juicy. They have them so like waxed together, you know. Oh sure. There we go. Nice. There we go. It's getting a little stressful around here. <laughs> I think once we pull one, we'll be good. We'll be in good shape. Nice. Okay. Do you want your bee brush? Cause how did we know that these that those are full of honey? Um, because they're capped off. See the wax, the wax is over the top of each one of the cells versus. See this one, we're not gonna take. There's only a few capped off there. And let the bees keep filling. So we'll up. leave them to work on this one. And this one's ready for us to take. So Emma, you take that. Get off there, little guy. Oop. I got a bee in my pants. I got a bee in my bonnet. I got a bee in my shorts. And it stung my leg. So I folded my pants up a little bit better. So one... One sting in. We're one sting in. Here. One sting in. Alright, and then do you want to show what this looks like in between the two boxes? Yep, so this is in between the two honey boxes. The top box wasn't quite ready yet, but we just took extracted an entire box that was all set and all capped off. And now this is what it looks like in between. Isn't so that beautiful? So these are going to be harder to get out because look at that's all full of honey and wax. So we yeah. have to pry all these apart and these bees are going to get pissed. Okay, so let's do this. Tell us how it went. Okay, it went good. Emma got stung in the hand twice. I got stung in the neck, but we got the honey and Emma rest, Emma noticed an eagle soaring over the puppies and Todd's taking care of them, so. Crazy day. Just another day. Just another day. Just, what did you do while you were home this <laughs> Okay, so we, we, didn't, we didn't take any video actually doing the extracting, so we want to show what happens. So after Emma and I brought the honey in from the hives, we brought it in here. And then you take a knife and scrape the cap off so that, and this is what the cappings look like. It's just wax, a thin layer of wax. And then we put them in these 
this drum, it's an extractor, and then you spin it, and then all the honey goes into the bottom of the extractor, and then it comes out into a bucket, and this is like the real, the, like the chips of wax in the top here, and then in the bottom, dun da 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 golden honey! honey. Like about eight gallons of honey. Yeah. So, yeah, it's nice, beautiful, golden. The final product. Honey. Pretty. Yay.